I'm Olivia Culpo, and this is Everything I Eat in a Day. I'm a breakfast person. I have to eat breakfast in the morning. Even if it's just a bar or half of a bar, I have to eat something, partially because I take a lot of vitamins, so I feel like I'll throw up if I don't eat, and also it wakes me up. I have a few go-tos. I really love an egg white omelet with spinach, tomato, and mushroom, and then avocado and toast. I feel like you have to have, I have to have fat in the morning because I take a lot of fish oil, so it's something that you have to take together. Just good for vitamin absorption, basically. I also love peanut butter and jelly, getting the fat from the peanuts. And the other thing that I absolutely love are perfect bars if I'm in a rush. They're so good. You have to keep them in the refrigerator, but you can travel with them and put them in the refrigerator. There's a lot of fat in them, but it's good fat. If I'm not making my own coffee, my absolute favorite is Blue Bottle Iced Almond Milk Latte. It's actually, sorry, it's Blue Bottle Iced Oat Milk Latte. I've changed from almond milk to oat milk, it's so good. But if I'm making my coffee at home, I usually use my French press, so it's really easy. I use this creamer, it's called Superfood Creamer by Laird, and it has MCT oil, coconut oil, it has all the healthy fats, so it gives you so much energy, I really love it. Again, it's a super high fat breakfast, but that's kind of what I like to feed my body in the morning. I feel like it jump starts my brain, to be honest with you. My Starbucks order is the egg white English muffin turkey bacon sandwich thingy, and then I just get a skinny vanilla latte. I think they just put regular skim milk in it. I'm clearly just not that picky. I'm like, whatever you guys want to give me, just give me that. If I'm gonna snack before lunch, I usually have nuts or um, a piece of fruit, and that's pretty much it. I try to have a lighter lunch because I feel like I get really tired around three o'clock, so I'll usually have a salad with a protein. For my salads, I love Mendocino Farms in LA. I don't know if you guys have that here in New York. I feel bad for you if you don't, but I'm obsessed with the Thai mango salad. It is so good. Also the quinoa superfood salad, also really good. The not so fried chicken sandwich is something that I'll get other times too when I'm absolutely starving. I'm like, I like to eat a light, a light lunch and then I'm gonna go and probably have like a sandwich. So I don't know, it kind of depends on how I'm feeling that day with work and everything. Some days you do need a little bit a little more sustenance for lunch, but I'm always really tired if I don't have something lighter. I feel like when you have, let's say, 5 a.m. call times, or you have to be up at five o'clock because you have to be somewhere for six, it's so long. The days are so long. So I do have a little bit of a process that I go by for my energy. Obviously, we have lunch on set and we have snacks on set, but a few things that, I, that really help me would be like, obviously, coffee, and then after coffee, I go to green tea, and then after green tea, I go to Diet Coke, and then after Diet Coke, I go to peanut M&Ms, and then after peanut M&Ms, I go to alcohol. Like that's literally how I get through the day. <laughs> and you know, actually one more thing that I've added to that long list is also liquid IV. I've realized that if you take liquid IV with water, you get so much more energy and you feel so much more alive because you're not always getting hydrated from water right away. So it helps, just extra hydration. A typical dinner when I'm with my family would either be chicken soup, because it's just like a warm hug. I love to make chicken soup. We also, um, I love to make homemade pizza. I love to make chicken parm. I love chicken, so I like to make a lot of different chicken things. Like there's this, there's this Chinese chicken bowl that I make that's really good. I make a lot of things in my air fryer. Bolognese, turkey bolognese, beef bolognese. I like to switch it up. I like to switch it up. It really depends on, on the mood but I like to make it an event. Like I like to plan in the morning what I'm gonna make and then make it a whole thing. If it's a date night out with Christian, we love to cook together. We cook together a lot. So usually I'll send him three recipe options and he'll pick the one and we'll make it together. He's my sous chef. I basically just like tell him what to chop and also some things are heavy or hard to open. Like he's great to have around. <laughs> We're more adventurous, but we're, we're homebodies. He and I always make these plans to go to dinner and then it rolls, five, six o'clock rolls around and we look at each other and we're like, there's nothing more that I would love than to just sit here and do nothing. There's always at least three different Ben & Jerry's options in my freezer. <laughs> right now there's Cherry Garcia, The Tonight Dough, and Half Baked. I also just made really good apple cider donuts. Like it's seasonal. My desserts are seasonal depending on what time of the year it is. I love Vide, but it's 99 calories, zero carbs, zero sugar. So it's really light. You don't have to feel a moral or you know physical hangover the next day, at least I don't, because it's so light. It's a good part of a balanced life because there's not a lot of calories or sugar or anything, so you don't feel bogged down. But I also love champagne. That's my other love. I don't like crickets. I think that's weird, I'm sorry. 
I know that's a delicacy <laughs> in some parts of the world. I cannot get behind crickets, but I'm not gluten-free, not dairy-free. I'm none of, I'm not vegan. I love Italian food, like I need dairy, I need cheese. <laughs> Three things I always need in my home to cook. My air fryer, I use that all the time. My mom has a pizza pan that's been in our family for four generations, so we, she ships it to me every once in a while. So if I have that, I'm making calzones, pizza, croutons, like everything bread related. Third would be my juicer actually, because I love fresh orange juice. And I also love fresh juice if you're making cocktails, if I'm making cocktails. Thanks for watching. That's everything I eat in a day. Don't forget to watch our show, The Culpo Sisters, on TLC, 9, 8 central on Mondays.